don't think I've ever done that before. Oh. 30 seconds. <laughs> I love that. It actually <laughs> like, that was like, helpful for me. Yeah, it was intense, but it was cool. Yeah. I forgot to breathe for yeah. the first 28 seconds. Uh, and I'm like, wait, why am I starting to get lightheaded? Okay. You feeling good? Let's do yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. So a little nervous. Woo. Well, 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 we'll get through it. So first question is use five words uh, to describe what you think kissing me would be like. Mm, okay. That's a good one to start off with. Five words. Mm -hmm. um, okay, bristly. Okay, sure. I like it. <laughs> That's a good starting point. I have really sensitive skin, so okay. when I kiss guys that have, you know. You just break out in hives. And well, yeah, or just I'm like, you yeah, know, okay. just sensitive. Good to know, yeah. Um, let's see, you have nice lips. Okay. I don't know, so I feel like it would be, okay, bristly, I don't know, fun? Mm -hmm. That feels like such a lame thing no, to say. No, fun's a great word. I would feel grounded. Like, I felt like grounded when we were just looking at each other. Mm -hmm. So, grounded, bristly. Fun, grounded, I don't know. Um, I, don't I mean, that, those adventurous. Um, okay. Because cool. you have the I mean, long hair. I don't cool. know. I think that. No, no, yeah. <laughs> Maybe you'll do a little lip bite. Who knows? I don't what's know. What's going to happen? Gonna happen? Yeah, I, I mean, I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I could describe myself. Um, and then five, what would be, I don't know, um, new. It would okay. be new. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. What about you? For me. With you. Good question. Yeah. Um, I think it would be passionate. The first time, for sure. Mm -hmm. um, I think it'd be a bit intense. You don't seem like you'd kiss somebody unless you really wanted to do it. That's actually really true. Um, you've got great lips as well, so I think it'd be quite like a voluptuous kiss. A lot of meat behind it. Uh, meat's probably not the right word to describe it. Um, <laughs> no one's explained my kissing like meat before. No, it's not a meaty. It wouldn't be a meaty <laughs> kiss, but we'll, 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 but that's not <laughs> one. And uh, yeah, I think fun as well. Okay. I think you'd be a fun kisser. Cool. Oh, there we go. All right. All so right. since we made out we with our words, Wait, can we what? exchange names? Are we yeah, I'm, to do I'm Cooper, by the way. Catherine. <laughs> Catherine, nice, <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. We're talking about kisses. Yeah, I mean, fuck. Name. We're already in first base. <laughs> <laughs> Describe what you think my apartment looks like. Oh, fun! <laughs> Wait, am I supposed to describe yours? Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait, why isn't she saying anything? Did I read that incorrectly? I totally forgot what we were doing. I, yeah, I was me too. like, oh, I'm so like, now you're going to describe your apartment to me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I would say it's minimal. Mm -hmm. um, maybe you have a bed. I'm not saying your mattress is on the ground. Okay. <laughs> but it's maybe low to the ground. Okay. I'm trying to think of like what I think is in your refrigerator. <laughs> if you knew what I did, you'd answer it pretty good. Um. So I'm, I'm in the process of developing, producing a cooking show. Oh! Kind of like Anthony Bourdain style. Uh, like trap, rest in peace, okay. of course, I love the guy. Okay, um, so that, I yeah. had no idea. That yeah. is crazy. So that was okay, kind so of you actually that, have like food yeah. in, okay. Yeah, so yeah, I, yeah, was yeah. I mean, that's, that. my, that's my therapy. Like okay. come home, crack a bottle of wine, and yeah. I could cook for five hours by myself. Oh like it's the greatest gosh. thing, I love it. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> what do you think is holding me back from being all that I wish to be? Oh, wow. Oh! That's a big one. I don't think anything's holding you back. Mm. I think you're exactly where you want to be and you have your set sight on something, but you're also enjoying what you're doing in the present. Um, you don't seem like you have a lot of self-doubt. Mm. Naturally quite confident. Mm. But if there was anything that may be slowing you down, Hmm. It's a tough one. No, I don't I don't think there is anything holding you back. Mm. That's such a like gift to hear. <laughs> Thank well, you. For I, I mean that. it. I didn't say that oh. for any reason but the truth. So yeah. I s struggle with so much fear and self doubt. You? Yeah. Like, fear of what? Um if you don't mind me asking. Yeah, of no, course. of course. Um I think fear of getting hurt. Like Fuck I used yeah. to think it was fear of failure. But no. I fail all the time. Like, it's not fear of failure. It's not fear of rejection. It's like I'm scared of bearing my heart mm. and bearing my vision, my calling, or whatever, and like feeling exposed and being sure. hurt. So, wow. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, and I'm right there with you. I mean, it, there's nothing that hurts more mm. than opening up your heart and getting kicked. Mm. Okay. <laughs> what would your ex warn me about being in a relationship with you? Mm. I wear my emotions on my sleeve. Mm -hmm. And when I feel, I feel hard. So when mm -hmm. I'm in love, I'm in love. When mm -hmm. I'm angry, I'm angry. Not never, and I can always manage it, mm -hmm. but there's no, um, I wanna say no stability in my emotional ride. Um, 
when I have my emotions coming out, they just have to come out. Mm. And so she, I think she, my most recent ex, knew how to manage that. Mm. It's not like I'm a fucking crazy person, yeah. but like I feel. A yeah, lot. you're a feeler. Yeah, feeler. Yeah. What advice would you give your daughter regarding love and relationships? Oh. What a perfect next question. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. Who wrote these questions? Who is this? This should be a board game. Um, okay. Oh, to so my daughter. Okay. Um, yeah. That love is always worth the risk. <laughs> I, I really do believe True. that. Um, I've, as every human, mm -hmm. experienced a lot of heartache in my life. Um, romantic and just friend-wise and family-wise. And yep. I think in those moments where you're, where you're just talking about that guttural, sure. like you're like, my body hurts. Like yeah. I just feel like, will this ever end? Mm -hmm. um, I just, even in those moments, I've been like, but it was worth it. For sure. And so relationships, what I tell her about relationships, be open, be mm -hmm. open to possibility, be open to the unexpected, be open to it looking differently than you thought or ex or planned for yourself. Mm -hmm. um, don't be afraid to go all in. Sure. Um, yeah, I think as you were saying, like we get jaded. Yeah, we, for we sure. We get hurt. For or sure. Like, like, well, I'm going to do that again. What about you? What would you tell your daughter? Oh, what would I tell my daughter? Um, mm. Love big. Mm. Yeah. If you feel it and you feel that there's some sort of re reciprocation, don't be afraid to tell them. Mm. And don't be afraid to love them. Yeah. Because like you said earlier, like love is, it is the absolute, mm -hmm. I, in my opinion, love is the absolute emotion. It's the absolute mm -hmm. feeling and everything is kind of just a sub of it. Yeah. Oh, I hear that. <laughs> I think I've learned more about you and about relationships and just life in general in this 45 minutes that I have on any date that I've ever been on in my I life. Was the, I was like, this is a really good first this date. This is fucking great. <laughs> wow. That's a really good first date. <sighs> okay. Do you think I feel, oh, do you think I feel chemistry right now? Mm. I am, I would say middle of, I would say yes and no. Okay. Like I felt moments where I felt that you felt drawn to me. Mm -hmm. And then I've seen other moments where your body language has been more like this. Mm. So do you know why I do that? It's because I don't know what to do with my arms when I'm having a conversation. <laughs> I'm like the guy that's like leaning on the bar like this because it's comfortable. I know. Where do I put my hands? <laughs> no, for sure. Oh. I find you fascinating. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I find you fascinating too. Well, there we go. Yeah. And cool. you're really cute. Yeah. Well, I appreciate it. You're gorgeous as well. Thank you. Hey, so if that video moved you, if you dug it, if you want to see more of them, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification button so we can keep you updated about our weekly releases. Thanks a lot. Thanks for joining.